we are just a few days away from the start of training camp in preseason and the Boston Celtics currently have three open roster spots trying to fill out this preseason roster. However, they have just made a move. According to Shams, they have just signed former Cleveland Cavalier wing Lamar Stevens to the roster in a very interesting move i'm actually very excited about this addition i recently made a video he was traded to the san antonio spurs but with the spurs being so young and trying to develop some of their young guys they decided to let him go and i knew right when he was released from the spurs there was going to be a lot of attention on lamar stevens because of the way he plays basketball because of his hustle and we all know marcus smart is now in memphis the celtics are missing some hustle they they need to gotta come in here to you know make that difference to you know fit Fill that role. Lamar Stevens is going to fill that perfectly. Now, I'm not saying he's going to come in here and be a day one starter by any means, but I really do think this is going to be a very solid addition. And I'm going to break down this video why I think Lamar Stevens is actually potentially even a perfect fit here for the Celtics going forward, at least for training camp in the preseason. We'll see if he can actually make the team. But before we jump into the video, do me a quick favor, guys. Hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, join the family. I will be covering the Celtics and the rest of the NBA all season long. Now, this video is going to be going to two channels, my Maddie Dubs NBA channel, and that is my brand new channel just for NBA news, and then my Bleed Green TV channel, it's also being posted to as well, um, which is just for Celtics news. So, if you're a Celtic fan, go to Bleed Green TV for all Celtics news. I'm also going to be live streaming every single cell game as well my main channel has about 58 59,000 subscribers right now so these two channels are specifically for nba and the celtics so join the family but without any further ado let's get into the video now lamar stevens has been in the nba for three years now playing in about 165 games starting in 38 of those and actually last season he started 25 games for the cleveland cavaliers now he shot about 45 percent from the field um, you know, over his career, averaging about 5.3 points per game, 2.8 rebounds, 0.5 steals, 0.3 blocks. But guys, although that didn't seem like a lot, that's only in 18 minutes per night. If you put that to a per 36, the man's averaging a block, a steal, 10 points a game. He would actually be averaging very uh, very solid numbers for a you know a wing type of role player and like I said before, with Marcus Smart being gone, the hustle, the tenacity, the defense is going to be a little bit you know concerning for the Celtics at points in times all we obviously know Derek White was a very good defender obviously made an all defensive team for a reason Jalen Brown is a good defender needs to get back to where he was a couple of years ago Tatum Chris Stapps Porzingis we have really good defenders but we don't have a guy that's going to dive on the ball or dive on the floor for loose ball Lamar Stevens does exactly that not only is he you know a great cutter offensively but he can rebound the ball he can defend at a very good level um you know he's he's six eight 225 pounds um listen he's a fairly good low a low post scorer uh, he can shoot off the dribble a little bit but not the best three-point shooter in the world he's definitely has to you know improve his shooting capabilities from downtown and i think boston will be a good spot for him to continue to develop his game uh, he's an adequate playmaker is very unselfish wants to pass the ball if he has someone open he will not hesitate to find the open man but he's also a guy who is not scared to shoot the ball which is good if you're open shoot the ball um, obviously as he continues to get better it's only going to be uh, you know better for the Celtics overall he's a good athlete a good defender can pickpocket can play good defense plays the passing lanes at a high level and is just a hustler so I'm actually very excited to see him on the Celtics what he can do in the you know the preseason the training camp period I think the Celtics still have two open roster spots but this is definitely a guy who I'm excited to have here in Boston let me know what you guys think give me a grade I would give this a a B plus right now uh, this you know this late into the offseason I would give it a B plus let me know what you guys think hit the like button subscribe if you're new join the family and I'll see you guys in the next video peace